Alright, so what's up mga kwentuhan? So nai tayo ngayon sa rooftop. Medyo yan, so napapansin nyo, gabi ngayon, no? Alright, so gumagawa lang tayo ng vlog for this session. So whatever goes, no? Kung ano mga, ano mga maisip sa sarili, uh, hinihintay ko lang yung asawa ko. So nagpapatulog ng bata. Um, so I think ang uh, isa sa topic na gusto ko i-discuss would be how was I able to gain 5 pounds in just 2 days. Yan. So, yun yung gusto ko i-discuss in this particular vlog. So, um, stay put until the end of this video. I'll definitely share with you the techniques, tips, and tricks that I did on how I was able to be successfully able to gain weight in 2 days. Alright? So, kita-kits tayo mamaya mga kwentuhan. Okay? Alright, so yan, so welcome back mga kwentuhan So, if this is your first time in my channel So, please make sure to hit that subscribe button And don't forget to click that notification bell, alright If you want it to be healthy and fit Physically and financially, alright So that you'll get to be updated Every time I post my video Every week Okay, so yan, so uh, Usapang um, gaining weight On how I was able to gain 5 pounds in just two days yan so mabilisan yan siya so yan ang kwento ko sa inyo okay so so mapapansin niyo ito nandito tayo sa rooftop ngayon no? so yan oh so ito yung uh, ginawa kong video kanina or the other day actually kanina pala yan so, nagbigay ako ng update so ito yung ginawa kong DIY na very small na um, greenhouse uh, para lang magkaroon something na mapaglalagyan yung ano yung grow box ko nung leto so yan so um, watch out kayo sa mga susunod na video ko kasi I'm planning right now to create yung uh, mas malaking greenhouse and mas maramihang planting nung leto so uh, gawin siya uh, mass production ng lettuce dahil I found out that yun nga yung hydroponics is something that is really very um, suitable sa urban farming meaning sa ciudad uh, we don't need, necessarily need to have soil para makapag-farm ng greens natin. When we're talking about green leafy vegetables, that is healthy. Um, and actually, it debunks yung notion or old, old um, knowledge that uh, we can only grow plants, trees, uh, sa lupa. And with this new knowledge, uh, it allows us to um, parang actually at parang but it allows us to farm or create and plant trees uh, vegetables just even dito sa mga rooftop or area ng bahay natin no? hindi natin kailangan ng soil or malaking area para makapagtanim so watch out kayo sa video na gagawin ko na yan okay so ayun so paano nga ba paano nga ba ako nag gain ng weight 5 pounds in just 2 days no um, I think I just have I have three or I'll, I'll share with you just a few simple things that I did kung paano ako nag uh, gain ng weight in just a matter of five days and uh, five days sorry uh, two days pala two days five pounds in two days so yeah so um, for the longest time similar nag lockdown uh, medyo na wala tayo ng access sa gym so uh, hindi rin, wala naman din tayong weighing scale for me to be able to measure yung weight that I wanted to have or maintain for the longest time no so as I've said in the previous video if you've been really following me in my channel uh, I've said that ang weight na minimaintain ko is 160 pounds and before the lockdown that was March I was weighing 160 pounds and um uh, so March, April, May, and then June, nag GCQ tayo, and then I was able to have yun nga, um, if you haven't seen that video, I was able to have an exclusive access. So I'll share that in this uh, link, you know, that's description box below. Um, ito yung video na sinasabi ko yan. Uh, or click mo rin tong video sa taas um, for you to be informed of kani siya sabi ko. Um, I was given exclusive access sa gym na pinagpupuntahan ko. 
and nagweigh tayo and I was uh, five or six pounds uh, below the weight na minimitate ko. So right after that day, I said to myself na hindi yan siya pede, no? So I immediately thought of ways on how I should be able to gain back the re- that five pounds that I lost. And ito yung pumasok sa isip ko. Okay? So, if you have pen and paper, take down notes. If you don't have, just listen to this video. Save it in your watch later and whatnot. Uh, para pwede nyo balik-balikan. Okay? So, step one that I did. Uh, ito na. Step one, simple lang. Uh, number one, you need to be conscious and aware of your eating habits and patterns. Right? Aside from that, uh, you need to also be consciously aware of the calorie intake that you are doing as the habit of eating that you have. No? So that two goes hand in hand. The eating habit and the calorie intake that you have. So that's two that goes hand in hand. Uh, hindi pwedeng eating habit lang at hindi rin pwedeng uh, calorie intake lang. So for me, at least based on my experience, it goes both hand in hand. So that's step one. Uh, number two would be uh, yung strong desire that you have to achieve the goal that you want to get. So for me, yung goal ko is to, to gain back that 50 pounds. And uh, the desire for me to get that back is really strong because um, <clears throat> I have a lot of reason why I'm maintaining 160 pounds. Maybe next video I'll share with you the reason behind it. but. Uh, that's the desire that I wanted. I wanted to uh, be at that um, weight, so 160 pounds. So that's my desire. I wanted to be at that weight, weightage. So that's second. Uh, number three is dedication. Um, you need to have dedication dun sa goal mo na ma-achieve. No? Uh, because if you don't have dedication or commitment, then all other process or all other steps is not going to help because you don't have the dedication or that dedication to do meet the target that you want right um, I think fourth um, fourth is consistency yeah so in your number four consistency you're doing um, because Kung hindi ka magiging consistent with what you do, then hindi ka rin, ta- hindi rin talaga siya makakatulong sa'yo um, overall with the, co- with the goal that you want. Uh, the last step that I did, which for me is really very simple, is surplus of calorie intake. No? Uh, ano ibig sabihin dyan? So, when I, during the, the last two months, no, during the last two months, actually three months running, uh, March, April, May, so yung running three months na yun, yung eating habits ko or eating patterns, I just eat twice a day, um, breakfast and lunch. And yung breakfast ko uh, is just about mga five maximum ten breads. Tapos, usually, ang mga pala- palaman would be, yun nga, peanut butter, um, cheese, yun lang naman yung usually common na palaman. Minsan, egg. Uh, pag medyo nagsawa, isang small can ng liver spread. So, yun yung mga ginagawa kong palaman. So, usually, yan yung, ano, yung, yung breakfast ko. And, uh, for, for lunch, kahit alung ulam. Uh, pero yung rice ko, uh, one cup, maximum one and a half cup. Yun lang yan siya. Yan lang yung, ano, yung, yung naging eating, uh, eating habit ko and calorie intake ko in a day, right? So, without knowing na I will drop weight pala of um, 5-6 pounds. So, nung nag-weight ako dun sa gym, yun nga, so 154, 155 pounds yung weight ko. So, that was the habit from the time na nag-lockdown. And then, right after that, I have the knowledge that I lost 5-6 pounds so I said na I have to gain it so simple lang naman um, dahil yun lang yung calorie intake ko so I just have to have surplus of the usual habits, patterns 
and calorie intake that I have. So, dinagdagan ko lang siya. So, for the remaining, for, for that particular two days na, so, yeah, so for that particular two days na uh, nagtatry ako mag-gain ng weight, so, dinagdagan ko lang. So, from one cup to one and a half cup before, so, naging mga a maximum of three cups of rice yata ako uh, for that particular two days. Uh, I did not increase yung calorie intake ko sa breakfast sa lunch lang and then nagkaroon ako ng ano ng small uh, snack during afternoons so yan siya so yung snack ko ano yung snack uh, biscuit uh, prutas so yun yung mga snack ko hindi, hindi ko na actually kinount yung ano hindi ko na kinount yung calories pero the mere fact that I have added one meal from the usual two meals that I have then definitely nagkaroon ako ng caloric surplus from the previous na two days of eating lang or two times of eating per day lang so I think based on experience and I was successfully able to bring back the 5 pounds um, yun lang yung ginawa ko to, to gain that 5 pounds back so nag gym ulit ako 2 days after uh, I haven't posted that video yet or more likely baka pag na post ko tong video na to na post ko na rin siya um, I'll share that that particular link sa description box na lang so tingnan nyo na lang siya doon or click this video above so para makita nyo rin um, so yun so I think basically yun lang naman yung ginawa ko um, for me to be able to gain back that 5 pounds in just a matter of 2 days no? maybe a lot of people uh, is struggling in gaining weight but um, for me it's just a matter of really being disciplined um, having that uh, caloric surplus or eating more than the usual and sticking to your plan and having that strong desire and commitment to meet that goal that you wanted no so yun yung mga crucial steps that you can follow if you if you are one of the few people if not a lot of the people who's struggling in gaining weight so you may want to try and do that steps hopefully makatulong sa inyo right so um, so yun so yun lang naman yung ginawa ko so if you did learn out from this video please help me um, share this to your friend and family don't forget to click that share and like button so that uh, marami tayong matulungan okay so makakakwentuhan so hanggang sa susunod na kwentuhan natin uh, at kita kits uh, ingat kayo palagi no kahit uh, nakalagpas na tayo ng GCQ medyo uh, marami pa rin tayong kaso ng, ano, ng COVID no? so always be safe be careful and keep safe and healthy makakwentuhan bye bye